What will they pay for and who it will be? We will see in this race. Three, two, one, go. Going on. Count down. Powodzenia wszystkim! Tak jest. We're off and I'm excited about sharing with you this third race in a row because I'm doing better and better. This was amazing. But I'm gonna talk a little bit more about others rather than myself on this race, especially guys like this one here, okay? So let me tell you guys, if somebody is overtaking the whole crowd of quite prepared amateur riders, it means that he's probably a pro with no points in this cup, he's just visiting the place and he's trying to shred, you know, the, the race and, and show everybody how strong he is. But uh, a little bit about me, okay? Three, three weeks ago I was 34th, two weeks ago I was 11th. This race I'm finishing at sixth place. Uh, two weeks ago I was starting from starting from the seventh sector, trying to overtake all these guys. And this week I'm starting from the third one. This is the guy <laughs> in the red and, and white. Uh, that's that you're going to see him a lot here and we talked uh, after the race with him and I said you have a really interesting construction in your in your mind when you're being overtaking you want to overtake back right away this is what he's doing right here and he said well that's interesting because I thought the same thing about you and I said but I'm just keeping my racing pace uh, and when you slow down, then I just overtake you with my pace. And he said, but I really thought it was you trying to accelerate and then slowing down and accelerating and slowing down. Guys, my pace throughout the, this whole race, again, about 34 kilometers long, just over uh, 20 miles and about uh, 3000 feet of climbing. It was really consistent. And from the beginning till the end, I was overtaking guys. Some ha have overtaken me, but then I would fight back most of them uh, till the beginning of the race. And what I'm gonna talk about now is all those matches. Each acceleration is one match. You have limited uh, number of those. And when you just try to fight with everyone who's overtaking you and who, whom you see on the, on the racing track, you are losing those um, matches for nothing. Because when you see such a long stretches of the road, of the fire roads, like here, uh, there is no point of overtaking people fast, unless you don't want them. This guy in blue, this is Junior, is also important here unless you don't want them to sit on your wheel. So if you want to overtake people and not let them uh, just draft behind you, then you attack. But that's not the case in most of the overtaking places. This is a downhill and then we have a switchback and you can see people who are trying to change the gear from the highest to pretty low right here and pushing pedals hard, they would lose their drivetrain. Like this guy uh, pushed his derailleur uh, in between the spokes. Okay, so this is the junior and I'm uh, coming to him because that uh, purple guy or red guy is already overtaken and I think he already paid for uh, all his efforts. But I'm, I'm now seeing two guys ahead of us. We have maybe seven kilometers to go and I'm telling to him, shall we get back uh, on, on the back of their wheels? And he said, he said, yeah, yeah, yeah. He just nodded here and, and he went off. So what he did was a strong acceleration. As you can see, I'm not even keeping up with his pace. This pace is too hard. You see, it's not his pace because with my pace, I took uh, to his uh, wheel. And then when we decided to catch those guys, he was trying to do it very quickly. I'm doing it really slowly. It took me about five to seven minutes, but I, I'm getting to that group. And this junior in blue, he came to them, then he overtook them and he set a high pace to them and he will pay for that. And I'm just now right here 
feeling quite well. My pace is really consistent. I didn't have to uh, go off the saddle. I didn't have to accelerate. Now these guys are accelerating and, and I'm asking this junior, is, is this a finish line uh, coming uh, right at us? And he said, no, we still have some something to go. I, I don't know why they did accelerate so much, but now we have a little bit of climbing towards the end of the race and interesting things happen. I have the feeling that everything is now uh, is now happening in slow motion. These guys, all of these guys, they have they slow down a lot. Like I see this junior can't even pedal here, so I'm overtaking him. So uh, uh, he won't get uh, on my wheel. And then these guys who just accelerated so hard a couple of minutes ago, they cannot push up the hill. If we had more climbing towards the end of the race, I would I would get a podium. Um, it's not the most important thing right here, but it, what I want to tell you is that I have kept my pace nice. I still feel strong legs, and I am able to overtake anyone on those uphills. We have some some uh, sketchy downhill right here. I'm trying to overtake some guys just by running. Besides besides them, which I did. And um, unfortunately, now we have a single track here, which means I cannot overtake. And these riders, to be honest, they are very slow, uh, technically, as you can see here. So I cannot overtake. I'm losing time uh, to those who are ahead of me, who are starting from the first and second sector. I, I was third sec sector right here. Uh, and I said to the camera, this is actually, the race is, is off right here. So I'm just chilling. Uh, preparing for some sprint finish because there there is maybe like 60 meters up the hill uh, on the finish line but here i just can can't do too much but just remember you don't want to race with everyone if you are a pro then you know your legs if you don't want others to go with you then you go hard but most of the time you try to keep your racing pace and your body will thank you for that at the end of the race which i'm feeling here right now i'm feeling really great uh, i didn't have enough um, battery life on my gopro so you won't see the whole finish i'll be just able to switch it, uh, switch it uh, back on for maybe a couple of seconds which is here and then the finish line that's it i'm feeling great i love it my body feels uh, great and i'm racing and i'm uh, training really lightly having better results that's interesting more about it coming up see you guys